Hey guys, Ralph here, and welcome to True Power Weight Loss Center, one-stop shopping for all your health and fitness needs. You want to lose weight, you want to lose weight fast, you want to run fast, you want to jump high, you want to throw harder. It's all here, one-stop shopping. Why can I make all those claims? Because it's one protocol for everything. Okay, you saw the thumbnail. Pablo Sandoval. Now, I am not a huge fan of Pablo Sandoval, per se. I, um, I'm a big baseball fan. I don't like the baseball that they've had today. It's, you know, bastardized version of the game I grew up loving. But Pablo Sandoval has been a, when he was on top, on top, he was quite a personality. He made an all-star team, and he is a flat, no, make, make no mistake about it, a stone-cold major league hitter. And there's not that many of them around. He's a stone-cold major league hitter. Not a big power guy. And that's fine. And that's sort of, you know, oh, how many home runs does he hit? Well, no. Stone cold, major league hitter. Right hand, left hand, 100 miles an hour, junk ball, can hit anything. And I don't care what you say. There's just not that many of them around. Now, the problem that uh, Pablo Sandoval has had since he came into the majors at his young boy is he's overweight. Now, in his first few years, he could handle it. He wasn't so obese that he couldn't move around, and he did beautifully. He was sort of a lovable teddy bear kind of personality. Never met him. I, I don't know what he's like in person. But um, he won three World Series with the San Francisco Giants on the team, and he was the uh, MVP of the World Series in, I'm not sure which one. Okay? Talented guy. And the fact of the matter is, if you've ever seen his uh, third base is his main um, position. Uh, and if you've ever seen a field, he's got great reflexes. He could be a glow, gold glove level fielder. I think he could even play the outfield. He's that, I mean, he's a huge athletic talent. He's just morbidly obese at this point and can't move can't move. So basically, you want him in the American League as a DH. Complete and total waste of talent, and he doesn't have to do it. He's got a minimum 10 more years. He's only 34 years old, and he could easily, the way he hits, have another 10 years, if not 15. And I mean that sincerely. Okay? Now, the problem is, is obesity. He's obese. There's no question about it. I'm not fat shaming. Quite, quite the opposite. I spent my life in the health and fitness field, trying to help people with this problem, okay? Now, I could get him back in two months. In two months, he would be down 50 pounds, easily, not even working out. He could be down, I will have him work out, but we'll get to that in a minute. 50 pounds, okay? He'd have more energy than he's ever had in his life. He's only 34. So he can remember when he was 15, 16. I guarantee you he'd have more energy than he's ever had in his life. He'd have more flexibility than he's ever had in his life. Okay? And I could give him more inherent strength than he's ever had in his life because we get rid of the bulk without ever touching a weight. That's just a fact. And I can do it for everybody. My doctoral dissertation was in pitchers. I have a book, True Power Pitching, 100 plus mile per hour. That was my doctoral dissertation. Pablo doesn't need, well, same thing, it's the same book, but he needs True Power Total Body. Okay? This is what I would do, and I would do with any of you, and I'm doing it myself. I'm on a juice cleanse at the moment and feel marvelous. Absolutely marvelous. It is better to look good than to feel good, and you look marvelous. Who's that, Fernando Lamas? I think it's better to look good and feel good, and you got the whole ball of wax, okay? And I could absolutely, 100%, do that for Panda, change his entire life, and his certainly his career, in two months, okay? This is what I would do for him. He's suspended. I would put him on the juice cleanse immediately, okay? 
immediately I would put him on a juice cleanse. Okay? He doesn't have to, we're going to have him work out, but it's not going to be what you think. Absolutely 100% have him on a juice cleanse. Okay? He would probably take a minimum 90 days. So this is September 11th to October, November 11th into December. Okay? Juice cleanse. He would drop 50 pounds immediately, if not more. Immediately. He, in two months, in 60 days, he'd be down 50 pounds. That in itself would give him his career back, but we're not done yet. We're not done yet. Also, I would put him on a bike. Okay? He's out of work. He has nothing to do. All he has to do is drink juice and ride a bike. He will be down 50 pounds so easily and so amazingly quick, which would give him more strength, flexibility, and endurance. His legs would have never been in this kind of shape. Never. Through the biking. We get a lot of, uh, due to the SFE exercises that I developed in the back of this book, he could easily develop more strength. I know he doesn't lift weights. He shouldn't lift weights. Nobody should lift weights if you want true strength, flexibility, and endurance. Okay? Football players, I'm not getting into it. That's, uh, that is a sport that I don't deal in. Weights may come in handy there. <laughs> Ask Tom Brady. When was, the last, when was the last time Tom Brady lifted a weight? Yeah, like never. He used to. He doesn't anymore. That's what we're trying to get with Panda. And that's what we could get with Panda. And there is big, big discrepancies in Tom Brady's protocol as well. But anyway, I digress. I'm getting off the topic. Now also, much of my research and much of my education came at the knee of the ultimate anti-aging guru, Gary Null. I studied with him for two years, had him at my absolute disposal, and it was the most, one of the most informative two years of my life. I learned more from him in two years than I did in my doctoral work combined. Okay? Now, he is also a proponent of a juice cleanse. Another story. Okay? But... The reason I'm bringing up Gary No, all these athletes, all of them, as soon as I get this up, I'm going to do one on Serena Williams, all of them have another 10 years. They are completely wasting their career on the weight room floor and at the dinner table. They're ruining their lives and their career. Now, I know at, this time, at the age of 34, Pablo wants more. He wants more. And why in the world wouldn't a guy want that lifestyle? Now this, guys, I'm telling you, this is not torture. This is something very, very easy, physically. What it takes, the juice cleanse and the ultimate diet, which is all in the book, it does take self-control. As Leo Tolstoy pointed out in his just amazing, amazing little thesis called First Step, the first step is self-control. Get control of the gluttony and the world is yours, Chico, and everything in it. It's as simple as that. And with his natural athletic ability, drop 50 pounds or more, he's going to be faster. He's going to be able to jump higher. He's going to have infinitely more endurance. Energy that you can't believe his mind is going to be sharper. All of a sudden, he's going to be up until into his 40. He's going to be a perennial 300 hitter. He's that kind of a hitter. I mean, he was working on half throttle his whole career and still made the All-Star team and World Series MVP. An enormous talent. Wasted. Now, I know Kung Fu Panda does not follow this website. But I'm putting it out there, man. You can have it all. You can absolutely have it all. You seem like a terrific guy. I can give it to you. Anyway, and I can give it to anybody. True Power Total Body, ten bucks. Go to the website at the end of my uh, at the end of my um, video here, or email me at the email at the end of the video, and I can attach it to an email. It's an ebook. Ten bucks. 
and the world is yours, Chico, and everything in it. Love you all. Eat and drink your fruits and vegetables and live your life with true power. Not the fake stuff, true power.